If you love the pen and paper feel of writing on your super note, but get frustrated when it comes to actually finding and reviewing your notes, I have a solution for you. This is gonna completely change how you use your device. I've been using this little notebook for about two years now. This is a smaller A6. The handwriting feels really good and writing on it really helps me think on paper. But when it comes to reviewing notes, it's really painful. There's a lag with every page turn, which I know is pretty standard in all the e-ink devices. But since we've become so used to smartphones and tablets being super responsive, the little delay I experience for every action I take on this notebook feels really frustrating. I feel this the most when I need to quickly find the note by flipping through multiple pages. And if I try to swipe too quickly, the device actually can't even catch up and it doesn't even register the gesture. There are other ways to navigate, like skimming through the pages using the slider, but you don't really know where you're gonna land. It only gets you to the general ballpark and then you'll need to flip through the pages to zero in on your notes from there anyway. And there's also the thumbnail view, but the images are way too small to see what's actually on the page. So to get around this, in the past, I would deliberately create multiple notebooks to ensure that a single notebook doesn't have too many pages. But this leads me to the second pain point. Organizing files, creating new notebooks, renaming them, creating folders, and moving notes around. Basically anything to organize your notes in Supernote is really, really clunky. Again, it's really the lag that's the problem. Every selection you make and every letter you type on the keyboard is painfully slow. Then I started using the free Supernote Companion app available on iPhone, Android, and Windows and Mac PCs. It's completely changed how I use my Supernote. This app allows me to review and organize my notes very quickly and easily. Let me give you a quick tour. Here's a desktop app. Once you open a notebook, you can use your keyboard arrows to flip through the pages. As you can see, it's super quick with zero lag. And on the mobile app, it's the same thing. You can just swipe to flip through the pages instantly, and you can also pinch to zoom in and out. If you've tagged your notes with stars, headings, or keywords, you can find them easily with this search function. And since I have all the devices set up to sync automatically to the cloud, I can access my notes from anywhere, even when I don't have the notebook with me. But how I like to use the companion app is to actually have it open while I'm using the notebook. This way I can quickly flip back through the pages for reference as I write new notes. Also, if you wanna do some housekeeping and organize your notes, the partner app makes it super easy. If you ever try to even rename a file in the SuperNote notebook device, you know how slow that is. On the app, it's like anything else on your phone. You can rename a file instantly. You can create folders and just drag and drop multiple files to move them around. It's the simple, fast experience we expect from our modern devices. Also, a cool thing you can do with this desktop app is you can drag and drop any supported file from your computer into the app. And it'll sync with the cloud and you'll see it in your notebook device. This is useful if you like marking up or annotating documents. So that's the solution. The companion app takes the friction away from the e-ink device. So if you think this is a good solution for you and ready to set it up for yourself, check out the next video. I'll give you a clear step-by-step -step guide to get your super note, computer, and phone all synced up perfectly. Also, make sure you're subscribed so that you don't miss the final video in this series where I share a pretty neat trick to use AI to process the handwritten notes you have in your super note. I'll see you in the next video.